I'm Nisa and I'm one of the critical care paramedics here at Cornwall Air Ambulance. Um, I've been involved in the medical fit for your new AW169 helicopter. So the medical fit includes everything that you see in the back of the helicopter, that's the flooring, the racking systems, the stretcher, absolutely everything is included. So it comes as an empty shell. As you can see, we've got our translating seat here. So this is where we sit um, on the flight. This is our stretcher system. And the great thing that we have about our stretcher system is that we get almost 360 access to the patient, which is obviously very important in the work that we do when we're conveying them to a hospital. So we got our two bags, and these are the bags that we take to scene and they carry everything that we need in order to treat the patient. Uh, one's predominantly airway and the other one's more trauma focused with our drugs that we carry in there. Next we have the, the Lucas. So this is our automatic chest compression device. Um, and this is great because it will deliver constant chest compressions to the patient and the great thing with this Lucas is it doesn't get tired like we do. Next we have the syringe pumps so we use these to give um, patients specific amounts of drugs that we need. This is our Zol and it does a lot of different things so it is a defibrillator so it gives shocks to the patients when they are in cardiac arrest. It also monitors patients, it monitors their blood pressure, their pulse, um, their oxygen levels but it also means that we can um, use other things on it like cardioversion and pacing for their heart. We also have our Hamilton ventilator. So this is the same one that they use in hospital. Um, so it's like bringing the hospital to the patient. So this is a fit of our current 169. Uh, for your new helicopter, we're going to make a few changes. So as part of the crew, we work on the helicopter daily and we've made some slight changes which will make um, work on the helicopter a bit easier and allow easier access to our kit. So the Lucas here, which is our automatic chest compression device, we're going to move to behind the seat here to allow us easier access. That then frees up a bit of space here so we can have a shelf um, which we can put our uh, medications on that we need to deliver to the patient um, and we're also going to have the introduction of a couple new pouches where we can carry some extra equipment. So everything that you see in the back of here is the equipment that we carry that is essential for us to treat patients and bring the hospital to the patients and give them the essential life-saving care that they need.